Okay, girls, time for the most difficult task of your life. Are we gonna teach the elderly how to use an iPhone? No. Thank God. We, and by we, I mean mostly me, are going to turn JJ into one of us. But I like who I am. Well, no one else does. Okay. Casey, this isn't gonna work. You can put a dress and some makeup on a nerd, but it's still gonna be a nerd. Stop. I don't need negativity in my creative space, okay? You know, I'm not actually that smart. Not everyone that wears glasses is a genius, you know. Um, but... Everyone shut up. I'm strategizing. This is going to be very difficult, but it can be done. I know it can be done. Let me examine my canvas. Okay. I know what to do. Well, I'm going to have to twist you because I can't see anything. Brush. You're in Casey's hands now. You will be beautiful. Yeah, okay. What's wrong? Nothing. This kind of hurts. Got some thick ass hair, girl. <laughs> like a wolf. Ow! Ow! Maybe it's pain, JJ. <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> you broke the brush. I didn't do anything. I'm just sitting here having my hair whipped out. What kind of conditioner do you use? Um, a four in one. Absolutely not. Spray bottle. Product. Are you ready? What am I, a dog? Wolf? <laughs> Spray bottle? Product? Are you ready? What am I, a dog? Wolf? <laughs> Tragedy. You're drowning me! You're drowning me! Stop it! Just water. That's enough! Hmm, it's like a spa treatment without the relaxation. Ow! You got soap in my eye! This wouldn't have happened if I had my glasses to act as a shield. Only a nerd would say something like that. Dyson? This is what it's like when I stick my head out the window in the car. Hair curler. Here you go. Oh, what the frick, Zoe? Dumbass, don't hand me the hot side. How am I supposed to know what side is hot? No one's home in there, huh? And where? I rest my case. Well, I'm not resting mine. Ow. Ow. Ow, Casey, my ear. Casey, my ear is burning. Oh. Oh. Beauty is pain. Beauty is pain. Beauty. Beauty. Tweezers. Huh. God, not even my dog has this much hair on her face. No, no, please. No, no, no. This is the least amount of fun I've ever had. Oh, the last time you groomed yourself. Okay. Makeup. Makeup. I don't know if I have your color. I literally have the same exact skin color as you. I think you're right. Mm hmm. Hmm. You're in luck. Great. Would you look at that? Concealer. What's that for? Imperfections. Might as well just cover her entire face. 
God, there's a lot. Your skin is atrocious. Thanks. What the hell do you use for skincare? Uh, water. Contour stick. Make her nose look smaller. What? What the frick is this? What is this supposed to do? Highlighter. God, why didn't you hand it to me open? Making me do all the freaking work. I have no idea what any of this stuff is. Blush. Are you serious? It's not that hard. Did you know if you pinch your cheeks really hard, you can actually just have naturally pink cheeks? Really? Yeah, look. Ow! What's a little late for that? Eyeshadow. Not your color. Give me a different one. No, that's not it either. No. That's, that's all we have. Oh. Okay, well, I guess that one's the least ugly. Stop flinching. Liner. Do I look pretty? Mascara. Can you hold still? It's caught in my eye. Okay, let's see my masterpiece. Your Majesty. Zoe is exhausted because only we, and by we, I mean mostly you, can take this and this and give you a okay. princess. I was not given easy materials to work with, yet this is my finest work thus far. I could cry. I took something ugly and made it beautiful. Yeah, that's great and all, but I can't see shit. You took my glasses. You can't wear contacts? Uh, no, I have a wear disorder where they just expel out of my eyes when I put them in, so. Of course you do. I guess you can just wear the glasses. Well, yeah, I kind of have to. Here. This is more like it. Still a nerd. Knocked down to a six out of 10, but. It'll do, I guess. Six? That's so kind. Brody is literally so hot. Oh, I think you just gave me a concussion. What is going on over here? We were just fighting about who we saw coming out of the janitor's closet this morning with Mr. Higginbottom. Zoe thinks it was Mrs. Mabubi, but I could have sworn it was you. I didn't see anything. Good, neither did I. My head really hurts. <gasps> Bitch, what the fuck? I have a deviated septum and you're deviating it more. Brody's my ex-boyfriend, you skank. Oh my God, can you guys stop? You've had like 26 ex-boyfriends. If you don't want one of them, why can't I have one? You're both idiots. Yeah, probably because Taylor just gave me a concussion. No, I don't think that's why. Sorry, we can't all be gay, Casey. It's really not that much better. Unless you're me, because I get anyone I want. Oh man, I forgot my locker coat again. She's gonna be so mad at me. Is that girl new? What do you want, JJ? I'm at work. Mom, did you wipe my locker coat down anywhere? I forgot it again. Hmm. I've never seen her before, but she's prettier than you, Zoe. Might have to replace you as my best friend, especially with that crooked nose. <laughs> no, I didn't, JJ. It's not my responsibility to keep track of your locker code. You need to learn to be independent and start to take care of yourself because I'm not gonna be able to do it forever. Is this about Brody? Because I won't talk to him again. Again? <gasps> I deserve that one. You need to go to the front desk and tell them that you forgot I your locker hate, combination like a big know. girl. I know it's not about him. I just have a reputation to uphold. I can only be friends with nines, no eights or tens, because I have to be the prettiest, but I also can't be seen with ugly people. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Wait. I am at work trying to put a roof over our head, and I don't need calls from my daughter who doesn't know how to do anything for herself. Whatever. Casey, do you know her? Hang on. What are you doing? I'm writing the answers to my science test on my hand. <sighs> You're so smart, Casey. Crunchy. So fucking annoying. Shit. I ran out of room.
Give me your hand. I'm gonna be fucking late for class again. Bitch, I have a blood condition. The ink is going to like seep into my blood and make my condition worse. This will be fine. Do you know that girl or what? Who? <sighs> There's no way. What? That's JJ freaking Johnson. The geeky horse girl? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna be late for class. You're high. Yeah, but I can still see. You guys got high without me? No, you were with us. Maybe I do have a concussion. No, you're just stupid. JJ. Come here. Me? Yes, you, dingbat. See? Told you. Wow. Uh, hey, Casey. What's up? And by what's up, I mean, why are you talking to me? Wow, she's rude, too. I like her. You look different in a good way. We like your new look. Oh, um, I just didn't have time to wave my hair this morning. Well, you don't look ugly anymore. What Zoe is trying to say is that you shouldn't braid your hair anymore. It makes you look like a dork. Really? It, it, it kind of like who I am, though. Oh, honey, nobody likes who you are. My mom does. And, and my dad sometimes. Don't wear the braids again, okay? Okay. You're sitting with us at lunch today, so cancel your other plans. Okay. Well, I mean, I didn't really have other plans. I usually just eat alone in the bathroom. Do not ever repeat that. See you at lunch. Okay. Bye. Wow. They're so cool. Oh, there she is. JJ. Hey, guys. Sit. Okay. It's so nice to have people to sit with for lunch. What is that? My lunch? Ew. JJ, it's okay to be poor, but we just don't want to flaunt it. My dad packed me that. Yeah, exactly. Okay, first rule of being popular, we don't bring lunch from home. We buy it. Okay, I can do that. I just I just don't have any money on me. Here, you can borrow my dad's credit card. I I don't think I can. Hand. Yes, you can. He won't notice the charges. Trust me. He really won't. No, I mean, I don't, I don't think the lunch ladies accept credit. Ew. No, I didn't mean to buy lunch here. We get DoorDash delivered. Here, order whatever you want. You're allowed to get food delivered here? Yeah, of course. Principal Asman is totally our girl. She lets us do whatever we want. Plus, she really likes DoorDash. Oh, there she is. Hey, Jesse. Jesse? You're on a first name basis with the principal? Yeah. Hey girls. Hey Jesse. JJ. What are you doing with popular girls? You're not popular. Um. We love JJ. She's one of us now. Eh. I am? Wait, you already know JJ? Well, yeah, I still am the principal. I have to know all my students. Really? Who's that? Um, that's... Ma Mary. I think I have a sinus infection again. Ma mm. Mark. That's Gerald. I've like never seen that boy in my life. Yeah, I have no clue to be honest. I don't actually do my job. I only remember JJ because I used to sleep with her dad. <gasps> Stop. What? SEQ? Eh, not really, but not too bad in bed. Ew, la la la, I can't hear you. La 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 la. No, 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 I don't want to hear about my dad in bed. That's really disgusting. Ew, la, I don't want to hear this either, I'm gay. La 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 la, no, no, I don't want to know this. La 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 la. I feel like I was supposed to be doing something right now. I'm traumatized. Oh shit, I'm late for a meeting with the superintendent. I'm gonna get fired. Just give him some please don't fire me head. That always works for me. Girl, how do you think I got this job? All right, I'll see you guys later. Is that what I'm gonna have to do to get a job? <laughs> I like her, she's funny. So, JJ, what's your body count? I've never hurt anyone. <laughs> I never, I would never. I like her, she's funny. I wasn't joking. So you met how many people have you slept with? Oh, well, that's a weird question. Uh, I have to think. Damn, she has to count? You're better than I thought. Okay, so my friend Cassie once. Nice, that's pretty gay. Um, Emma, one time. My aunt Linda. Oh, my cousin Jenny. What? Mm, my oldest sister Mia. What is wrong with you? My mom. You're disgusting. What? What? Y you... You asked me how many people I've slept next to before. You thought we, you thought we meant how many people you physically slept next to. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were serious for a second.
<laughs> JJ, you're a fucking riot, dude. I didn't know you were such a prankster. <laughs> what the fuck did they mean? Just smile and nod. <laughs> okay, girls, the final touch. Hi, JJ. Where's your Urban Cowboy perfume? What? Uh, I don't have one. All the cool kids have Urban Cowboy perfume. Yeah, because it smells good and it's vegan. Think of the horses, JJ. What do you use for perfume? Sometimes I rub the inside of a lemon on me. It kind of stings. Well, you can't sit with us until you smell like blossoms, okay? Wait, but how do I get one? We bought it on the TikTok shop. How do you buy something on the TikTok shop? Figure it out. Call us when you get one. <laughs> that was weird. What? <laughs> what the heck is going on? What the fuck? Okay. All right, class. Maybe I was just hallucinating. Please take out your urban cowboy perfume. What? JJ, I said take out urban cowboy perfume. What the heck is going on? <laughs> what the Mom, Dad, something really weird is going on. All the kids have urban cowboy. All the cool kids have urban cowboy. Now my friends will let me sit with them again because I smell good. If you want to get one just like me, you can get one by clicking this button right here. Try it. Click it. See what happens. So who are you going to prom with? Prom? I'm a freshman. So? You all go to prom. With who? I don't know, like any of the creepy seniors that want to bring a younger girl? Well, who are you going with? <laughs> Brody. Brody. Brody asked you? Yeah, he asked you too. No, but he doesn't have to. We're a thing. He knows we're going together. I don't think he does. Maybe it's because you're a thing with a lot of boys. <gasps> you freaking bitch! I just got my eyelashes done! Oh, boo-hoo! Go cry to Brody about it! The only time I cry to him is of happy tears from our sex being so good. You slept with my Brody? Yeah, and he has some freaking amazing moves. I gave him those moves. Yeah, well, you also gave him chlamydia. Chlamydia is not a big deal. It goes away with antibiotics. You would know. Oh, you're a freaking bitch, Zoe. <laughs> So they're best friends. Yeah, that's how they show their love. It seems kind of toxic. Aren't all the best relationships? No. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> fucking, fucking hate you. Hey, remember that time we dated for like a week and then I dumped you? <laughs> Shut up. Nobody knows that and it's gonna stay that way. To this day, I still don't understand what I was thinking. <laughs> it's cause I got that concussion and couldn't remember anything or think straight. Like literally, I was straight before that. <laughs> And then boom, head injury, and I'm suddenly gay and dating you? I don't think so. Maybe someone hit you over the head with a flying pan. What? <laughs> Do you know something? No, I don't I don't think so. Girls? Let go of me! Oh, no! JJ? Mom? You're home? Am I home? Bobby? Wh whose house are we at? Oh, is it not familiar to you? It's probably because you're never here. Now listen, young lady. I had you very young, and I didn't get to have fun because I was raising you. Now, you're old enough to take care of yourself, and I want to go out and get laid, okay? Your father was a deadbeat and couldn't last longer than two minutes. I have never known satisfaction and happiness in all of my adult years until now. Okay? Why does it have to be my dad? I have never known satisfaction and happiness in all of my adult years until now, okay? Why does it have to be my dad? Oh, he's just one of many, honey. Does he know that? No, but when you care about someone, you don't tell them things that are going to hurt them, okay? I don't think that's great advice. Well, you know what? You don't get out much. That's true. Why am I even your friend? <laughs> what are they doing? Arguing over a boy. Girls, knock it off. Life is too damn short to be fighting over boys, okay? I can hate you. Let go of my hair. You stupid bitch. There's plenty of him to go around. Didn't your mother teach you that Sharon is caring? I don't want to share Taylor's chlamydia. <laughs> Yeah, no, don't share the chlamydia. Never mind. They'll figure it out. Okay, bye. You can leave now. Uh, wait a minute, young lady. I was coming to see if you wanted anything at the store. I'm going to run some errands. What store? Lick. Uh -uh. <laughs> Licka licka. Or do you like Saturday sips better? I'm good. I have enough for the weekend. What? Okay. You need any condoms or anything else? No, still gay. Yeah, I still don't know how that happens.
Kelly, Taylor. Yeah. You need any condoms? Yeah, get me the biggest box you can find. I have a long weekend planned. Freaking bitch, so weak. Okay, um, what what size condom? <laughs> the we. The biggest ones. Brody's not even that big. Maybe you've just never got him fully hard. What? Uh, okay, the girls are giving me headaches. <laughs> now I remember why I have to come with <laughs> Not calling me! What? Stop it! What? You should have Oh my god, Zoe Taylor, knock it off! Apologize and make up. We have more important shit to do. Sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. That Brody likes me better. What? I said I'm sorry. I like you so much better. Okay, so prom is in a week. Taylor, can you please just let Zoe go with him? Why can't you go with your boyfriend? <sighs> Fine. She has a boyfriend. Okay, I need help deciding who I'm gonna go to prom with. This is very important. How many people have asked you? Three? Damn. I really value all of your opinions. Except JJ, she's still learning. Fail enough. I'm just happy to be here. Okay, I've made a very important PowerPoint to go over the pros and cons of each candidate. Please pay attention. This is so extra. Do we get popcorn? Okay, first candidate. That wasn't a rhetorical question. Rose. She kind of looks like me. No, she doesn't. She's way prettier than you. 17. Femme. She lay. Pros. Super pretty. She is pretty. Captain of the cheerleading team. Super wealthy family. JJ, are you paying attention? Sorry. Has leadership qualities. Probably good in bed. That's fair. How do you know that? Next. Okay, the cons. Crystal lesbian. What's a crystal lesbian? Small boobs. I have small boobs. There's nothing wrong with small boobs. Shoes with mouth open and hooked up with Emma Whitlock. Hey, I like Emma. I mean, everyone's hooked up with Emma Whitlock. Candidate number two. Okay, now she looks like me if I put my hair in a bun. Now we have Dylan. Oh my god, stop flattering yourself. 16, switch, she, her. She's also way prettier than you. Pros. So smart that she skipped a few grades. Pretty hot. I have a question. Big booty. Never mind. Plays basketball. That's hot. Definitely equal as much a top as a bottom. I don't understand this lesbian slang. Very important. Again, how would you know that? Next, we have Colin. Do guys do this? Kinda young, not a sugar mama. That's a hard pass. Brody is her brother. Oh my god, that's Brody's sister? Shorter than me. Ew. And drinks cow milk. Should I be taking notes? What's wrong with cow milk? It's a red flag. Next up, and lastly, we have Max. Next up, and lastly, we have... Oh, wait, they're cute. Max. 18, trans mask, they them. They literally Max. look like me, too. It's older. Can call them daddy. I'll call them daddy. Taller than me. I like that. Haven't dated anyone non-binary yet. Skateboards. Hot. <sighs> this is like getting boring. Always smells amazing. Okay, and cons? Have heard that they're a pillow royalty. I see what you did there. Oh, I get it. That's it. That's all the cons. Oh, is there one more candidate? What is this? What's that? No, no, no please. No, no, no. Casey, what is this? No, I literally don't. No, no. Is that me? No idea. Okay, what do we think? Are we just gonna ignore what just happened? Taylor, I'm not gay. I don't look at girls like that. That was helpful. Thanks, Taylor. I'm so confused. Okay, what do we think? Are we just gonna ignore what just happened? Taylor, I'm not gay. I don't look at girls like that. So helpful. Thanks, Taylor. You're welcome. I'm so confused. Zoe, are you freaking sleeping? Oh, what the hell? You know what? You guys are kind of abusive. You fell asleep during my presentation. Um, last time I checked, school ended two hours ago. Whatever, who was your favorite? Um, the, the redhead. There was no redhead. I mean, the one that started with the letter, um, D? Dylan? Yep, Dylan, that's the one. Mm, I don't know. Oh, and Brody's her brother. We can have a double D. What am I supposed to do? Hang out with JJ.
JJ, what do you think? I don't know, but whatever one you don't want, can I go with? I'm not looking like that. You need a makeover first. They are all way too hot and mature for you. Okay. We need to fix that. So this is my room. Wow. It's surprisingly clean. What's that supposed to mean? Nothing. I'm just kind of shocked. That I'm clean? Yeah. Uh, I swear I am. Look. Here's my test results if you don't believe me. No, that, that's okay. Okay. I really am. You can sit down. Get comfortable. Okay. <sighs> you don't look very comfy. I'm comfortable here. This is so comfy. Come on, I don't bite. Unless you're into that. <laughs> I don't know. Come here. Okay. I like your wall color. Thanks. My mom picked it out. Twirling ice. So, um, do you want to watch a movie? Yeah, we can do that if you want. Okay, what movie do you want to watch? It doesn't matter. Not like we're going to be paying attention. Oh, look! I found a remote! Oh, I like this movie! Oh my, that hurts. Oh look, I love this scene. <laughs> this is so funny. One piece. Sure. Thanks. I'll just throw this away. No, don't worry about it. I'll take care of it. I'm really thirsty. Can you get me some water? Um, yeah, sure. Bear back. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> okay. I'm back. Yay. Did you miss me? <laughs> yeah. There you go. Thanks. It's good. Now where were we? Wow, that water went through me really fast. I have to pee. I'll be right back. JJ. Yeah. Do you not want to kiss me? Do you not want to kiss me? Um, no. It's not that. I've just... I've just never kissed a boy before. Well, I've never kissed anyone, actually. Oh, well, I don't mind. I can teach you. I always thought my first kiss would be with a girl because I thought I was a lesbian, but you confuse me. I get that a lot. Really? No. I think, I think I want to kiss you. Okay. Hold on, there's something I have to do first. This is a big girl moment. Calls for a big girl hairstyle. Okay. You look good. Okay, come here. I'm here.
You ready? Yeah. You? I guess. Yeah. Don't be nervous. You're gonna love it. Okay. I really hope so. Oh. Yeah, sorry, Carlos. I'm gay. I'm definitely gay. Okay. That did absolutely nothing for me. Okay. Close. Sure. Wow. I feel so much better. Everything is so clear now. Happy I could be of service. Well, I'm gonna go. See you at school tomorrow. See ya. Why does this always happen to me? Carlos. Here. Unfortunately. Mike. You. JJ. JJ. Absent. Thank God. Hi. Sorry I'm late. Uh. Oh, I, um, I didn't realize we were getting a new student today. New student? Are, are you talking to me? Yes. What is your name? Uh, J J Jane. Well, Jane, welcome to the class. Yep. That's me, Jane. You can uh, have JJ's seat for now. She's not here today. And hopefully never again. Okay. What? Why is everyone staring at me? J JJ? Shh, she thinks I'm Jane. Maybe I won't get yelled at today if she doesn't think I'm me. Hey, Carlos. Hi. Are you okay? Yeah. I love having my heart shattered into a million pieces. Sorry, I can't help that I'm gay. That's what they all say. What? Um, you look different. Yeah, I know. I look so ugly. I didn't have time to braid my hair this morning. No, like, you look really hot. Hi, did you forget about me? Your girlfriend? Oh my god, I did. I, I'm so sorry. Sometimes I just, like, forget that I'm in a relationship. What? It's just, like... Slips my mind sometimes. Like, like when? Um, oh, like, like yesterday when I was at Brody's house. I'm sorry, what? What? Did, did you hook up? Yeah, but I just told you that I forgot I was in a relationship. God, Nova. Nova, sit down. No. What happened? What was that for? Principal's office! Now! Gladly. She is so dramatic. What happened? What was that for? Principal's office! Now! Gladly. She is so dramatic. Bro, those badass. Well, Mrs. Aspen, at least you have another seat available again just in case JJ comes back. Shit. Well, hopefully she doesn't. You really don't like her, huh? No. She is the worst, most annoying, unteachable student that I have ever met. Okay. I'm so grateful that you have joined our class, Jane. You seem like a delight. Yeah. Something tells me that JJ won't be coming back. Oh, wow, not even I'm that dumb. What? I was just saying that I'm dumb. It's good to be self-aware. All right, I have to use the restroom. Study silently until I get back. Restroom is code for being in the janitor. That means we have like 45 seconds before she comes back. So, and JJ, I think I'm, like, single now, so... Oh, really? Did, did Nova break up with you? Well, I, like, just realized that I accidentally, like, cheated on her, so honestly, if she doesn't, that's, like, a big red flag. What? So, and JJ, I think I'm, like, single now, so... Oh, really? Did, did Nova break up with you? Well, I, like, just realized that I accidentally, like, cheated on her, so honestly, if she doesn't, that's, like, a big red flag. What? Carlos. Carlos. What? Little question. It's like no big deal. What? Um, so like, would you like let me borrow JJ for like a night? Like, like a little swing situation? First of all, you have nobody to swing my way. Right. Secondly, JJ dumped me. What? 
yeah, we kiss and then she realized she's a lesbian. Oh my god, that is like the best news I've ever heard. Well, not for you. That sucks. Yeah. You're kind of looking rough. Do you like need a friend to talk to? Yeah, I kind of do actually. That would be really nice. Okay, you should probably call one of them. Hey man. What's up, dude? Um, I'm like failing this class and I was I was wondering if you could like maybe like tutor me or something. I'm I'm failing this class too. Oh I mean that that's that's fine. We could like maybe like figure it out together. What? I don't know, dude. I just like heard what happened between like you and JJ that she like dumped you and I I thought like maybe you could use some like comfort or like cuddles. Uh do you have, like, a, a sister? No. Like, I'm not gay. Bro, I wasn't asking. I'm not gay either, bro. I was just, like, trying to be a good friend. Dude, we, like, barely know each other. I'm so sorry for, like, trying to make new friends, bro. Okay, well, I thought you were, like, trying to offer me, like, a rebound situation. Um, but if not, I, I, I don't, I don't want to cuddle you. Is it, like, because I'm a dude? Yeah. I could, like... I could like put on a dress, bro, if you're into that or something. I'll I'll let you know on that one. All right, but yes. All right, so for this one, you're just gonna sit right here and oh shit, uh, let me increase the weight. That's way too light. Okay, you're just gonna grab it like this and pull it straight down and squeeze your sh shoulder blades together. <sighs> One, two, three. Oh. Okay, yeah. Oh, yeah, that was that was good. Impressive. All right, you try. Okay. Yes, it just like that. Just like this. Hey, let me get it for you. All right, it's probably gonna be pretty difficult, so just go easy. And if you want me to lessen the weight, just like let me know, okay? Like this? Oh crap, did I, did I lessen the weight? Dang, yeah, I, I totally did. Let me uh, increase it for you. Oh, okay. All right, that should be a little more of a challenge for you. I don't feel much of a difference. You know what? I think this one's broken. Let's try a different one. Okay. JJ, what are you doing here? Oh, my boyfriend lives here. What What are you doing here? Uh, this is my friend Carlos. We're on a date right now. In the apartment complex gym? Bro. Uh, hi. Who are you? Hugo. But most people call me Papa Bear. Yeah, no thanks. Hugo works. JJ, how do you know this creep? Creep? This is my guy. We've been going to the same gym together. I've been training her. What? You've been playing me? Yeah, I'm sorry. You just look so excited to show me how to use basic gym equipment. I just didn't want to wait on your blade. No, you're not. 100. Oh. Wow, did you just do a hundred push-ups? Yeah, piece of cake. Mm -hmm. Impressive. Yeah, pretty cool that you have this gym in your apartment complex. Yeah, it's pretty chill. I come in here like every day after school. Why would? I was thinking we could like work out for a little bit, you know, get the juices flowing, and then like go hang out in my room. Okay. Bet. All right, you might not be able to do this, but it's okay. Just try your best and. Don't get discouraged, all right? All right. All right, I'm gonna do like 10 pull-ups and then you can just try one, okay? Sure. Okay, you got this, Carlos. It's, 
it's, it's pretty hard because you have to like pull up your entire body weight. It seems pretty difficult. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, done. Your turn. That was only five. I thought you were doing ten. Did I say ten? I meant five. Mm -hmm. So I just hold on to this and pull myself up five times? Yeah, but honestly, I'll be impressed if you even do one, so don't worry. Okay. I thought you said this was difficult. This is really easy. Whew. Are you just making things look really hard to make me feel better? You're such a gentleman. Yeah, you, you caught me. Bro, that's pretty messed up for you to befriend a child at the gym, showing her how to work out. Fucking creepy, bro. First of all, little man. I'm not little. It's okay to be a short king. JJ is like a sister to me. I care about her more than my own family. Secondly, I have a hot man upstairs waiting for me to finish warming up my arms. So what? Oh. Carlos, don't be rude. Papa Bear is the only family that cares about me. My dad drops me off at the child care center at the gym every single night so he can have the house alone to have sex with his bimbo. And the child care center stops accepting children at age six. But my dad seems to have forgotten that I'm a teenager. And the child care people felt so bad for me that they gave me a free membership to the gym because they think I have a neglectful parent. Which I do. And Papa Bear is a tweener there and has so generously offered to twain me for free. Oh, I'm over this. Carlos, can we go? Yeah, I'm watching you, man. I know where you live. If you break her heart, I will break you. And you best believe that I could do that with one hand, little man. Carlos, you're sweating from your quash. I think you may have pushed yourself too hard. Yeah.